Now to an audit in Ocean City, and you will not believe what it revealed about first responder overtime hours. Coast TV News reporter Kevin Zappé shows us which Ocean City departments were really punching the clock in the first three months of 2024 and why. Ocean City first responders worked a lot this year. According to an audit presented to Council, the first three months of 2024 had police and fire working hundreds of hours more than the same time last year. Rich Martin, who lives in Ocean City, says overtime is worth whatever it costs. Overall, I think it's a good thing. I mean, I don't mind paying to have the resources here or the officers present. When comparing March 2023 to March 2024, the Ocean City Police Department had 720 extra overtime hours. Ocean City Police thinks there's two reasons why. One, court dates that officers were required to attend to for cases. And two, OCDC says more officers take vacation in the earlier part of the year since they need to be working during the busy season. But Barbara Boris wonders if the overtime is caused by overstaffing. I think it's excessive when I see somebody pulled over that obviously poses no threat, but you know, two or three police cars will be on the scene of it. And I wonder if that's the best use of their time but not just the police had an increase in overtime hours. The Ocean City Fire Department did too, with 1,510 extra overtime hours compared to March 2023. The Ocean City Fire Department declined to make a comment right now and are looking further into why those three months were increased compared to last year. When reviewing the audit, one council member expressed concern on why there was such a big jump in overtime and suggested future conversations to find out why and what's next. I'm Kevin Zappay in Ocean City, Coast TV News. And this brings us right into our Coast TV poll. We want to know how should the town address the issue of rising overtime hours? Let's take a look at the updated results on your screen here. It's the majority still at hire more staff. That's how they say to address it. That's at 65% right now, while 28% say improve the management. Just 7% of people who voted in the poll say increase the budget. If you haven't voted yet, it's easy to do. Go to coasttv.com or use our Coast TV mobile app.